At LAX, Thomas Lubbering is carrying a torch lighter. Since 9-11, this type of lighter is not permitted on flights. He wants Southwest to hold it until his return. You know, they're not expensive. It's just I've had it for 20, 15 years. So why can't we make arrangements that this would be, we have a, a place, and if you don't pick it up within 60 days. But unfortunately, if we kept everybody's lighters. Right, hundreds of thousands here, a day, I right. don't think so. So is your suggestion to hire somebody just to take care of things that and you little incidentals with these people that used to never be a problem is now it's a problem. But unfortunately, with all the changes after 9-11 and everything, and these couldn't... But these terrorists are affecting everybody, and it's not right that little stuff like this, because I could have matches, they so where's the locker? Don't they have lockers that are quarter and you put a not locker? since 9-11. Nothing that... Everything the the not mailboxes are sealed. There are no mailboxes here. People used to just mail things back to themselves. They can't do that anymore. Those are sealed. The lockers are sealed. And those are all things that are beyond our control as a carrier using this airport. This is really a, a, a catastrophe, and how many people are upset every day because of this? Let me ask you something. Don't you sell everybody's lighter and everybody's pocket knife? You got them up there by the ton, and then you have a big auction at the end. That's TSA. That's what I'm Airlines saying. So somebody's not, making money on it. I don't know that they sell those items. I don't yeah, know they what do. they do. They, they confiscate them. them. I know they that much. And then they sell, they sell them they by do. the pound or whatever, and so somebody's making money. You might want to ask them what they do with them, but I know they confiscate them. I don't know what they do after that. Okay, so that's my memory and history, and it's now yours, right? And there's no options. There's no, here's here's our receipt. You don't get it. You can't claim it. It's not even an option anymore. Right. The TSA upstairs, if you would like, has a bin that people put stuff in, and you're more than welcome to put it up there so that you don't have to give it to Southwest Airlines. Well, it's not that. It's I just mean, we that also I... don't want the items because then it's our responsibility to dispose of them. All right. Uh... That's just exasperating. But I know that I I'm only voicing it's not you. You didn't make the rules. I feel like I'm in a foreign country now, and that really is annoying. And, and it's not something that I've created. It's something that someone else has created and really pushed me to where I went, what is going wrong? He hasn't flown that much since 9-11, and a lot of the rules have changed. And he was unaware, so we just wanted to try to educate him. So leave these at home, unless you pack it in your luggage. But you probably should just leave it at home.